Good day, Westside. Our art walk and auction is quickly approaching and it is time to get inspired. So we're coming to you today to share some inspiring images to help you get your creative juices flowing. And uh, please remember that the art walk and auction is taking place on the evening of April 29th. We will have childcare on site that evening and plenty of fun activities for you all to enjoy. Uh, please remember to keep an eye on the newsletter and other communications for more details. I'm looking forward to seeing you there. Happy creating. Hi, my name is Melissa Zier and I'm the Director of Marketing and Communications for Westside Montessori School. I'm joining you today to share some ideas for our upcoming Art Walk and Auction event with the theme of Starry Starry Night. And as you can see, we've got a piece up here that's done in pastels. We're, we're welcoming several different mediums. Here's another one that's a mosaic style done by stone. Uh, here is a metal piece that's got some whimsical elements to it. This is another piece that was done with mixed medium. This piece was actually a digital piece of artwork, but would lend itself well to uh, stained glass. For those bakers in our community, we would love to have auction items such as cupcakes or cookies uh, with the theme of Starry Starry Night. We've got a few pieces here that feature different pets done with that uh, same impressionistic style. We've got a lighthouse. So this just gives you a basic idea of how we're planning to utilize the theme throughout our event. And we want you to have fun with it. You can pick any subject that you want. I know we had a vote for different themes and several folks voted for a jungle theme or a safari theme. And we would absolutely encourage you to go ahead and carry out that inspiration, but maybe do so with this impressionistic, whimsical style. And of course, we had to throw in a couple of owls just because that's our mascot this year. And again, here's a stained glass piece that's beautiful. So if we have any craftsmen in our community that do that, we'd love to see it. Uh, painted furniture, highly encouraged. These are just a few other ideas. Maybe you do a piece of artwork and it's got a frame around it with uh, that sort of theme. This one is a, I believe a lino print where it's, it is carved out of a block and then ink is applied to it and it's run through a press. But you could probably accomplish something like this with uh, the scratch art pieces that typically come in white or black and you scratch it off and it shows color underneath it. And I think the kids would love something like that too. And these are macaroons. So these are another baking idea that we wanted to throw out as well in case you are inclined for that. So please don't feel that you are boxed into just doing landscape scenes with uh, the sky. You, we're just encouraging that you use this impressionistic style throughout the event and for the different pieces. So here is uh, the plates. And if you are a big wine drinker, maybe this would be a fun project for you as well. And these are other pieces that we found online that are in that similar style. And here's a wood carving. Actually, I believe that this was probably done using a, a laser, but you could do wood carvings. This is another mosaic piece done with uh, beads and glass. If you are big into embroidery and cross stitch, you could go that route. We've got some more wine glasses. This is again, another a carving. Had to throw the owl back in. Uh, and it doesn't have to be square. You can have fun with it. So whatever you want your canvas to be, it's absolutely welcome. We're just encouraging creativity. We want you to have fun and play. 
And this is actually a piece of furniture. So if we have any uh, craftsmen out there skilled at epoxy tables and such, I think that would make a beautiful feature piece for our auction. And these are different cityscapes. So if you have a city that's near and dear to, you, to your heart, you may consider doing that for your auction piece. We've got another cross stitch. And those are just a few ideas. Um, we would love to encourage you to think outside of the box and come up with some ideas, uh, including those I haven't shown here. So we look forward to, come, to see what you come up with and we can't wait to see you at the event on Saturday, April 29th. If you have any questions, please reach out to us at WMS at westsidemontessori.com or give us a phone call at 281-556-5970.